How's it going everyone? This is Maximilian, and welcome to the first of many hopeful quick tip videos for Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 where we cover something small that can help you improve the game a little bit more, or a feature that I think should be important. Uh, and in this video we're going to talk about Heroes and Heralds and playing the game offline with a friend. Uh, so as we discussed before in the previous video, Heroes and Heralds did not come in the DLC of an ability for you to play somebody else in Heroes and Heralds unless it was online. You can't even play your friends in like a private setting online, you're pretty much stuck to ranked matches only for Heroes and Heralds. But there is a way around this, and you can actually play locally, um, it's just a little bit tricky. And a lot of you guys already know how to do this, and a lot of you actually mentioned it in the previous video. I just want to make sure everyone else knows, because so many people still ask that they can't play Heroes and Heralds with their friends. So, here's what you do. You fire up training mode, you select your team, and you select the, the characters that your friend would want to use, or whoever you're playing locally with. Once you get into training mode, and then you're actually on the stage, you go into the options of the game, and you can actually set the ability card, so they allow you to train with Heroes and Heralds, and the cards to get good with them. But they also allow you to set it for the opponent as well, so literally what you do is you change all the options to normal stock settings, set your meter to 1, don't restock X-Factor, let X-Factor be level, uh, let X-Factor be normal, and then don't turn health recovery on. And instead of having the dummy be just, you know, a dummy or a CPU, you can set it to be a human opponent. So the game will reset, and at this point you're going to want to press start and select, and bam, there you go. Meters will actually count down to a KO victory. You won't get the nice start screen and ending like rematch and stuff like that. The games will just restart, but at least there's something. There's actually something in the game where you can play each other in Heroes and Heralds and actually enjoy the game offline. So hopefully you guys found the information in this video useful. A lot of you mentioned it before and I really appreciate it and it's kind of cool that this is actually in the game in some form that you can play offline with your friends if you want. So if you wanted to have it Heroes and Heralds like party with a few people, you can do it. You just have to do it in training mode. Please rate and subscribe and look forward to the next quick tip Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 video where I discuss something else that's been heavily questioned in many of the videos since the Online Warrior has started for ultimate and it's how to wave dash properly or more specifically how to wave dash backwards and how to properly use a method called plank dashing that could make moving around a lot easier thanks for watching everyone this has been maximilian and i'll see you next time